hello friend welcome back to my channel so the previous video i was show you how you can actually create a google account a gmail account and in this video i'm going to show you how you can properly customize your google account how you can put your profile photo how you can set up your phone number recovery email addresses or you can change how you can change your phone number or recovery email addresses and your personal information how you can change them how you can add them so i will show you in this video all of those stuff so for this i'm going to my gmail.com as you can see i'm going to log in on my gmail address my gmail id and then i will show you how you can actually customize and change all of these things so here is our previously created gmail address as you can see that was zayad ahmed8299 at gmail.com so so now we are going to customize our gmail so from from this part we will simply go to manage your google account you just have to press manage your google account and this person as you can see here you will find personal info you have to press there personal info so here you can see this is your basic information all of your basic information is mentioned it there as you can see so very first you have to photo add a photo to to personalize your account so you can simply add a photo on your google on your google id for personalize your account so if you press there if you press this photo icon as you can see if you press the photo icon you will find the option add profile photo and here is written a picture helps people recognize you and lets you know when you are second in in to your account so this photo actually will help you to recognize you for other people if they want to find you or if they want to you know what i mean if they want to find you this photo will help you to recognize to other people so simply you have to you have to go add profile photo and then you you, have, you, you can either you can use a camera if you are using this from your phone or a laptop which have a uh, which have a webcam you can choose this camera option and then you can capture the photo instantly either you can you can choose upload if you choose upload then this this option will open and you, you can either you can drag and drop the photo here or you can choose photo to upload so if you press choose photo to upload basically so it will actually open my library okay it will actually open my pc library as you can see and from there we can choose any photo for our you know new by google account so i'm simply using this photo okay for test purpose you can choose your photo or anything you want so i just choose this photo and actually you can you can as you can see you can crop the photo or rotate the photo according your wish okay you can either you can rotate it or you can keep it as you want okay so we are just using this this part okay let me show you how you can do this you can use a part of the photo I, I'm, I'm 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 going to do this this option okay and then i just have to press save as profile picture as you can see you just have to press there save as profile picture so this photo will be set up as your profile photo okay here you can see profile picture will update soon it could take a day or two to see the change across to across all of your google services actually google saying it can take up to one days for publish this photo on your all of google services but i i, I see that it, it actually doesn't take that much time uh, basically it's it's just changed instantly as you can see our photo our profile photo has been set it up okay and as you can see in the name option if you want to change your name if ever anytime if you interested to change your google name you can simply press there name and size number so as you can see so you just have to press there and if you interested to change your name google will give you an option so here you can see change name option so if i want to change the name i can simply remove the name and add my new name okay so i'm going to show you if i want to change the name i'm just changing the name for this email 
this email id so it could be anything previously that was my name now i'm going to put something else like shamun and ahmed anything if you want if you just if you just want to change the name you can change like this way so it has been saved then you have to press this back button so you can see that name has been changed by the same way if you want to change the date of birth if you want to change your date of birth so you can change from there you will give an option there you can delete it and you can put your new date if you will ever interested to change i know there is no no chance no way for change the birth date of birth because this is the one date this is not changeable but if you ever interested to change the name you can do this from there and then you can see choose who can see your birth there if you want to uh private your birthday like if only you know you can see the birthday you can make it only you uh if you want to public your birthday then you, you have to press anyone so if you press anyone also see here of people who can see your birthday that means if you press anyone that means anyone whoever if you send email to someone or if you use any google service then anyone can show your date of birth so i'm just going to put it simply only you and then i'm going to save it i just save it so it's there gender if you ever wanted to change it you can <laughs> change it from here you know and also choose who can see your gender either you can put it only me or you can choose anyone so we are going to keep it only you okay so and the password okay as you can see there is the option for password so if you want to change if you ever wanted to change the password you have to press there and when you will press there google will actually ask you for put a put your previous password so i'm going to put my previous password there and then you have to press next and then you will find the option there for new password so i'm going to put a new password i'm going to put my new password and then after that if you press this i button so you you can see the your password actually then you just have to press the change password so this way your password will be change okay so and contact info there is your email this is your primary email as you can see that i made it to the online gmail.com and in beside this this is your recovery email okay so if you ever wanted to change your recovery email you just have to press there you just have to press there and then you can change it you can change your recovery email from there so you have to verification needed there is a questions you have to verification needed so same way when you will press there the google will ask you for password for change, for make this changes so from there you can change your recovery email okay and after you changing the recovery email you just have to log into your this email address uh, your recovery email address and you have to confirm you have to confirm your email email addresses that yeah you confirm that this is your recovery email so i will show you in another video how you can actually confirm this email address okay so and then if you go back your profile see how you how your different different profiles appear in google services so if you want to see how your profile will be shown into different services in in google map this is actually show you like this way let me show you in google your profile will be shown like this way like in your name and your data that type of information okay and then if you go let me close this tab if you go google gmail and productivity apps see profile so uh, in there your profile will be shown like this way okay so this is just a basic i'm just trying to show you the basic things okay so 
so that that was actually a very simple video about how you can customize how you can add a profile photo on your gmail how you can change your name in gmail how you can change your gender your password your recovery email addresses okay and if you want to add your recovery phone number actually you can do this from there in contact info you will find phone option and from there you can add your phone number okay so i will show you in a, another video how you can add a phone number on your google google account okay so thank you so much thank you so so much guys for watching the video i hope you, this video will help you and if you like the video then please don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel and subscription to my channel will be so so much appreciated thank you guys i will catch you in the next video thank you so much for watching the video bye bye